Okay, this is uh, Essentials 2014. I'm just going to drag the toolbars off of there and onto my second monitor. That's about as gone as you can make them. And uh, what I found that worked is just to go to Tools, Toolbars, and select one of the other of these. They, they pop back. That's uh, Tools, Toolbars. I, I normally use Child parent child toolbars. But anyway, wherever you drag them and lose them, and you, that brings them back. Now this is an essentials. Hang on a second, I'm going to open up uh, Home Designer Pro. It's a little bit different. But all, all the Home Designer titles ought to be like one or the other of these. <coughs> I haven't pre-rehearsed pre the uh, Home Designer Pro one, so uh, we'll just see what happens. <clears throat> okay, now these toolbars here, I'm just going to get rid of them. I'm dragging them onto my second monitor. When you have one monitor, sometimes you can drag them off like that. Now they're gone. Now you go to uh, Tools, Toolbars, Customize Toolbars in Pro. It's a little more complicated. And then you open this dialog here and go to the Configurations tab. And then I'm going to select Default Configuration and then click on Switch To. Well, they didn't come back. Uh, let's see. Okay, that brought them back. I picked it, this one here. And I'll switch to... Oh, I see. They're jumping over to my second monitor when I use the default configuration because I customized them. Let me just uh, pull these back in here. Drag them back over from my second monitor. I got, got one more. So I'm finding out how this works myself, but uh, you open this, uh, let me show you again. Close this. You go to Tools, Toolbars, Customize Toolbars, and that gives you this dialog here. Which, this is not a tutorial about customizing your toolbars, but just getting them back. <clears throat> we'll go over to the Configurations tab, and uh, we'll switch to the... You see how they pop right back up in there? And we'll go to Space Planning and switch to... And there's the Space Planning toolbars. And the Terrain Configuration switch to... Anyway, they come home. Now, the default configuration, I... I quote, customize, unquote, and so that they're floating because I made them float. Now, once you get them back, I'm just going to pop them into place. That's fine. And I think this one goes commonly over here. So drag it over there close to that right-hand side. And uh, I'm going to drag, put this one down here. See, the toolbars would kind of snap into place. And let's see if I can add it up here. I want to put that. There we go. You wanted to put it up over there, and I just drug it into place. And I suppose I could probably drag this one up here. Yeah. Anyway, that's a little bit about toolbars. If they disappear, use this dialog here to bring them back. And uh, they are customizable, especially in uh, Home Designer Pro. So just keep that in mind, and when they disappear, make them come back. Okay, thank you.